Two cubes of the same size are made from smaller green and white cubes. Which one has more green volume? To answer this, most kids directly dive into calculating the exact volume. But there's a much more elegant way. Let's start with this cube. The first layer has five green and four white cubes. Since they are shaded alternately, the next layer has five white and four green cubes. And the final layer again has five green and four white cubes. In total, there are 14 green and 13 white cubes. So the green volume is 14 out of 27, or 51.8%. Similarly, in the other cube, the first layer has 13 green and 12 white cubes, followed by 12 green and 13 white, and so on. In total, there are 63 green and 62 white cubes, making the green volume 63 out of 125, or 50.4%. Since both cubes are of the same size, the higher green percentage in the first cube means it has more green volume. What if another cube of the same size is made from even smaller green and white cubes? Will the green volume increase or decrease? Problems like this push kids beyond formulas into creative thinking to find elegant solutions, making them math fit.